So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today guys, I'm going to showcase to you how you can get 75,000 runes for more or less no work at all, no enemies fighting back, they're basically free of charge guys and it is quite simple, it will take you roughly about 5 minutes uh, if that, uh, but yes guys let's get into it, how's it going guys my name is DPG and if you do enjoy the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe. Also guys, if you do want to join my growing Elden Ring Discord community, join my Discord down below people, come chat about the game, find players to play with, share your secrets, whatever. Okay, so first up you want to get yourself a weapon what causes blood loss, which is a passive effect obviously causes blood loss build up. Now there are many weapons in this game that have this, the Uchi Gatana base weapon the samurai start with have this uh, it's absolutely amazing not gonna lie but if you don't have this kind of weapon it's probably wise to get one now you don't need it it'll just take you long without it i mean you like I said, you don't actually need it, but if you do want to save yourself some time, I have the actual location of where you get Uchi Katana, uh, this weapon where you get this thing from, and you'll see that on screen now. So you want to come to this spot on the map right here, and then you'll have to go through these doors. Now you do obviously want to uh, activate this grace, not do two which ways about it, just in case you do die. So you come straight back here. Well, you shouldn't actually die in here because you ain't got to fight nothing really. I mean, there's enemies in here, but you just run past them, follow the route I take on screen. Now, just run past these, run straight down the steps, turn on yourself, go left, go left again, and you'll see just there, just pick it up and you are good to go, guys. So once you have this, this is this is all you need, people, to actually kill a dragon that's seemingly asleep, that doesn't move, and it gives you more or less 75,000 runes. Okay, so you want to come to this point on the map, where I'm at right here. Now, it isn't too hard to get to if you're a basically a starter player you can just follow just follow the direct path you can follow the path along the top uh, just slightly north of this and come down or you can just go straight here it's not too bad if you got your mount just just mark it on the map guys and run straight here so activate the grace simple as that and then all you need to do guys is come down this hill which i first thought was just a wall and then i realized it was actually a breathing dragon the great thing about this thing is guys it doesn't seem to fight back so all you have to do guys is just stand next to it, this side of it, so the grey side of it, I'd probably go through its tail if I were you, and just chop it. Now like I said you need that blood, you don't need the blood loss, but the blood loss actually gives you like an, a massive chunk of damage, at, well seemingly random, I don't think it's random, I think after a certain amount of damage you do, you get a massive chunk. I was doing at a level 35 about 13 to 14k damage and you'll see it made things a lot lot quicker so just stand here guys chop away cause that bloodlust build up and you'll see his health will just absolutely drain once you kill him guys you get a dragon heart and you then get the 75,000 runes people well it's 74,000 blah 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 but it's basically 75,000 round it off let's round it off so yes guys you want three 75,000 runes which will help you level up an absolute ton come here now like i said you don't need a weapon with the bloodlust build up effect on it but it just makes things much much quicker so yeah i hope you enjoyed the video guys if you did leave it a like it really helps out if you're new around here and want to see more Elden ring be sure to subscribe and hopefully people i will see you on that next one